What do the scriptures really say about homosexuality? I'm John Stone Street, and this is The Point. The publishers of the New International Version have released an updated translation. Among the updates to the 2011 edition are certain verses that refer to homosexuality. Rather than bowing to political correctness, the translators helpfully clarify the Bible's original message. Instead of saying, quote, homosexual offenders, the new translation describes the act itself. Many of the euphemisms have also been removed and replaced with more literal terms. Why is this helpful? Well, one of the misconceptions about Christianity is that it condemns same-sex attraction, but it doesn't. It condemns homosexual acts, and for that matter, heterosexual acts that violate God's design. It's assumed in our culture that feelings justify actions, and if the church can learn to communicate the difference effectively, it could be a turning point in the cultural debate and for a generation of folks struggling with sexual brokenness. Come to thepointradio.org, and I'll link you to a new article from Chuck Colson on this topic. I'm John Stone Street.